Hello and welcome back to Hidden Collections. Today we're doing a small collection video of a couple of small collections that I got from some people online. One of them, this first one here that we're going to go through is uh, one where a guy found, found it in his closet. And so he was just posted online, not very, not asking too much for it, but we'll go through it. We got some base set trainers. Uh, he said he was just going through and he's moving uh, some Neo cards. And so I decided, I was like, hey, this much. And he said, sure, it wasn't too expensive to get since it was such a small, small little collection and everything. So we got some first edition unknowns here. A lot of unknowns, a lot of Neo sets, another first edition unknown. A Seedra from Fossil. And I think we're getting into some of the fossil cards. A horsey, Kingler, Krabby. Then we have some early Nintendo era cards in this. Team Aqua's Hideout, Team Aqua Schemer, Team Aqua Ball, a Sfeel, Celio, another Celio, a Cedra, and I believe if I'm right. Just a bunch of psychic energies, a couple of water, and then some of the some water energies. Let's see if I can spread those out. Well, there. So it wasn't much to this one. Like I said, he found it in his closet, and he's like, "I don't want them anymore. I'm moving." And I said, "I'll take them." Let's go through some of the here. So we have the promo, the movie promo, Electa Buzz. It's in pretty good shape. Overall, there's some wear on the bottom. If I can get it to focus. So, we have an unknown. G. Where's that? There's a little bit of wear on the side. Like, these cards are going to be great because I didn't collect any of the Neo card. Like, I went into Genesis a little bit, but not into to Destiny Rev. And everything so it's great then these can start my collection we got a couple Skyridge Snorlax just some there's some random cards I put it in here this Skyridge and it's in good condition there's a little bit of wear on the bottom here the reverse foil Aquapolis Slowpoke so uh, I feel like his those sets were printed less that those cards even in a little bit dinged up condition are still worth something you got a Pikachu or not Pikachu, a Pichu <laughs> right there then we have the a couple of the Team Aqua cards we have let's see here, let's start with the Kyogre right here, rare non-holographic so and then we have the Lairlin holographic so, they, I mean, light play to them, everything. They weren't going to be in pristine. Then we got a Chansey EX. Right there. There's scratches on the front and everything. Some wear at the top. Then we got an Electabuzz EX. I was really super excited when I got it. I was like, there's this giant swirl. There's a swirl right here at the bottom of it. And see it move. And everything. So that's all for that one. And then these cards I got, I think, with another purchase. They were sent to me. Because I think I bought some vintage packs. And then I think the one I ordered, they didn't have or they sold it. I think it was a long stem to a short stem or vice versa. But it's a bunch of, I believe, first editions from Fossil, everything. Like I said, when I do these collections, I'll be checking conditions. Well, let's see this grimer here. It's got a little play around the edges and stuff, but I'll be checking condition of these compared to the, uh, the cards in my binders already. So uh, if I'll be switching them out and seeing... This, or I'll start, because now i got quite a few first edition, I might start um, 
some of these sets in first editions, just switch them out and have an unlimited set and a first edition set might be another goal to have for the channel. So it makes it, you know, really good when I find something like this and I get all these first edition cards that really help and everything. Uh, Arbok, and then we move into Gym Heroes, uh, Slowpoke, Ghastly, Lieutenant Surge, Voltorb, Ergo's Execute, like, um, I already have a lot of these Gym Heroes, Gym Challenge, Commons, Uncommons for, like, Erica and Giovanni and Misty, but not a lot of Brock's cards, Lieutenant Surge, so it's good to have these ones to help fill in the binder and so I'll probably do a couple uh, collection videos of smaller if they're like small like this I'll probably do a couple and then do a binder update after those and if it's a larger video I'll do an update after that to see where we're at and see what cards we're missing so we'll see Sparrow and the other lieutenant sort of Sparrow. So one's a common, one's an uncommon. This is the common, this is the uncommon. So let's move these ones up forward and into it. And these were kind of just random, felt like a little bit more random of rares. Like we have, we don't need all of them. Uh, we have a holographic hypno. And so I'll be checking this one's condition compared to the one that's in my binder and everything this to see which one's better I know I don't have this bling for gym challenge so I will go right in and then we have some Neo Gen we have a Neo Genesis Esmeral it's got a swirl right up here the top I think the the card overall around everything is in good condition, everything, but that's why I put them in these semi-protective sleeves because it's the hollow foil is the part that's all scratched up on this one. I mean the card all over. I mean it's there's very little marks to show anything, so it's in good condition. We got a light Azrael. I think this is the same. So this one's a little bit has a little bit of that foiling around the top. See if I can get that and stuff, but it has a little bit more play to the top of it. But it's in like great condition. They're great binder cards to keep the sets going, and so that's why you know I was thinking about doing the Neo ones, and this is making it now. I'm getting some more of the cards, and then the very last card for this one. Will be a dark vaporeon from Legendary Treasures. So they upped it to a rare and gave it a foiling from Team Rocket, where it was an uncommon. I really like it. Like this card, the same. Great centering everything around. No real edge wear or anything. It's only that's the hollow surface. I don't know if I can get it. Is the part of it that's got most of the wear on the card so and that's going to do it for this video uh leave a comment below of what was your favorite card from you know the watts era from the sets or what set was your favorite and everything to see you know what what was it i was like i i just liked a lot all of, it, it's hard for me to narrow it down i'm pretty sure I, I will be able to after getting them all back and be like this one was it this was my favorite but, so hit that like button, subscribe, and hit the bell so you get notified of new videos. Until next time, have a great day. Thanks for watching.